ideas of where to focus some of my energies so that I'm not, you know, taking the shotgun approach. Right. Um, what I want you to do specifically, Carl, since you're early in the journey is take some time and think about what's a perfect voiceover day for you. The perfect voiceover day. What time are you waking up? Where are you living? How are the day's voiceover gigs coming to you? Is the limo pulling up and taking you to the studios? I mean, I, or is it all is it all happening via email? Or are you taking the bus or the subway to you know in the in the city where whatever city that you're doing it at? How much money are you making? We all want to make as much money as possible. What what's a realistic number? What would be like the the number that would be like okay? I've paid my bills, I can save for retirement, I can go on vacations, I can enjoy my life. And then think about what the day before that looks like. And the day before that, and the day before that, and all the days before that, until right now when you're sitting here listening to my nonsense. You know, write that down, be very specific about it. Be very specific about it. And then if you can start to reverse engineer that, deconstruct that perfect voiceover day. And kind of figure that. Oh, I. Oh, I. Can you? Can you? Does everybody smell that? Everybody can smell the wood burning right now. Carl's already thinking. Uh, but like, do do that exercise, and it will really. Because, like I said, the more the clearer that you can come up with it. Because here it is. You want to be a doctor. Okay. You go to high school. You get great grades. You go to university. You get great grades. You go to master. You go to mass. You go to. You get your masters. You get great grades. You go to doctor school. You get great grades. You pass. You pass all your. You pass all your tests. Then you get your internship and resident track. Very very clear. I want to be a voice actor. You know what I mean? Because everybody comes at it from diff different areas and everybody wants to go to different places and do and be different things. So the more that you can kind of come up with a, a path for you, that it's okay to change it. Because here's one thing I've also learned, Carl, is that you may not be good at what you like and you may not like what you're good at. There's a lot of people coming in the industry to do, for example, cartoons and video games. And they just, they suck. But they've got a knack for medical narration. And it's like, oh, okay. But Tom, medical narration is boring. Yeah, you know what else is boring? Being hungry. 